I'm Jackie Morales. I'm a sophomore. I'm a comm major. And yeah, Mango is my emotional support animal. The reason I have him is like obviously because like I have to like get him out of bed to like take him out on walks. That keeps me busy, but it's not like where I'm like too busy and it's like interfering with my school and like school work. Um, I have severe anxiety and depression, so for a while I've been talking about getting one and my family was like, no, like you don't like it so much, you know, you don't have a job, it's gonna be hard to care for him and then fly back and forth between California and New Jersey with him and like all this stuff. It eventually got to the point where I was like, I can't like physically like be alone. I just need like something that's like unconditional love, like that I like, have to take care of besides myself because like it was like at the point where like I wasn't taking care of myself because there was nothing else that like needed me to per se, I guess. I skipped so many classes, like I literally had over six absences in like every class and like thank god my teachers were understanding because I like explained to them what was going on. It's just like nice to like come back from your classes and have this little cute little puppy greet you and be so excited that you're back even though you've only been gone for an hour. So an ESA is a lot easier and cheaper. Essentially, you could have really any animal as long as a psychiatrist or a psychologist or like your doctor writes like you need this like because you are diagnosed with this, this, and this um, and you would benefit in these ways and like they've discussed this with you and by this law like they're legally allowed to have it in like places. So like if I were, were ever to move into an apartment off campus that didn't allow pets, he would be allowed to stay with me because of that letter. They don't have to be like trained to like detect something like a service dog. They have to go through like immense training. It's a service dog, but it just costs so much money and they have to be like extremely well trained. Like they're not supposed to like divert their attention to anything else like when they're on duty and like nothing like that. Like Mango literally gets like, I take him outside, he sees school and he's off, like that's it. Like he could like, that a service dog would never do that. And so there's like a difference in like that sense just because he's not trained in a way to like detect my anxiety yet or like anything like that. Mm -hmm. He's getting better. <laughs> I mean, he's honestly, like if I didn't have him, I probably would not be at LMU anymore. <laughs>